After the tour, the members return home to spend time with their families. But they will be home for a lot longer than they planned. Having parted with their manager during the tour, their careers stalled for months. And rumors began to surface that D. Woods was moving on and Aubrey was joining the Pussycat Dolls. From Danity Kane or from my Pussycat Dolls? Which is it? <laughs> a little bit of both. Which, are you going to be on the Pussycat Dolls? Is that what it is? Are you still on no. Danity Kane now? Yes, I'm still on Danity Kane. Are you going to stay in Danity Kane? Yes. Definitely? Danity Kane stays with me, sure. Well, okay. I mean, why are you saying it like that? You don't know what the deal is? Yeah. Don't know what the deal is. Really? Yeah. When it comes for you guys to get together and do stuff, I mean, who goes out and makes the contact between everybody? I used to be our manager, but uh, we don't have one anymore, so at this point, it's just us. Well, D. Woods just left the group. Is that true, or? I don't, I mean, I'm, that's what I saw. Yeah. Drea and Shannon and I, you know, talked the other day, but I don't know. Oh, she's so not wait, returning I mean, your call, dude. That's No, crazy. I mean, I don't know if it's that, but I, yeah. you know, I can't, I mean, I honestly can't sit here and tell you either way whether it's true or not, which right. is sad. Despite the rumors, a second album was announced, and all five girls returned to New York to meet with Diddy. You ready to get busy? Yes. Yeah. You understand? We're like, so we on, like, we're like, let's go, let's, like, let's start working, let's do this. Let's, we just want it to be better than we feel like it could be something so much more. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But once again, Aubrey, let me talk to you. Stay for a second. Diddy would have issues with Aubrey. <sighs> what now? <laughs> Aubrey had begun to change her image since they had met. And Diddy was not happy. Some of your decisions, some of your choices affect the group. Like whether, what? whether it's you decide to turn your eyes green or you decide to get a weave or you decide you got to get that approved on how it's gonna affect the rest of the group. The stuff that I seen of you in the press over the last couple of months, I don't think it was beneficial for the group. I'm cool with a problem child in the group. You you can't be the problem child this album. Okay, I respect that. All right. Cool. My relationship with Puff is a difficult one for me. We constantly butt heads, and I constantly feel the need to butt heads. But at the end of it, I realize this is the job that I chose, and this is my dream, and nobody's going to take that away from me. Down in Miami, the girls began recording songs for their second studio album. But as the album progressed, the girls grew frustrated with the music they were given. We are working on the sophomore album, and these songs that we've received just don't match us. I'm just confused of where our direction is going. Okay, we're gonna find it. We're gonna find it. It's really hard to go in and record songs that you don't like and that you know that are slow. Even though the girls have been drifting apart. This conflict rallied them back together. We're fighting because we love DK, because yeah. we love Bad Boy, because we love Puff, because we want a good we album. Want you gotta trust plan. the man's vision. We're just so different, and we all absolutely hate, 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 hate. This stuff that, that some of the stuff that y'all are really saying is, this is gonna be 08 for you guys. Us we sitting will. here doing this with the yeah, negative energy, fight for and it. nothing's and getting recorded right, right now is not the answer. Here. Right now, we're wasting time on something that we cannot change. So you're telling us that us has record a bunch of oh, mediocre songs so that hopefully... Why do y'all think the records are mediocre, though? They are. We don't have the time for this, and it really will become a problem. Y'all guys forget that we're the one who has to sell the song. We're the one so who has to mean? sing the song Do you, song think, do you really believe day? that you'd be better off just recording an entire album on your own with just yes. what you guys like? Yes. You know how many artists make that mistake and f*** their careers? With tension at an all-time high, Diddy stepped in. Orby, you ain't got nothing to say? You got such a big mouth when I'm going. What you got to say? Say it now. This is very personal to us, and as an artist, I think you would understand that best. We just want to love what we're doing, and I know at the end of the day, there's going to be, we're not going to love everything. It's a give and take. It's a compromise. This is a business. I get I it. I saw y'all. I believed in y'all. I chose to invest my time, invest my money, my energy in y'all. Y'all have to have trust in me. Well, not all five of us have walked out of a studio yet and been like, I want to hear that song every day for the rest of my life. That is my I got it. We just want to love you. what we do. That's it. All right, I got you. One thing that, that, that I want to do is definitely, you know, apologize to y'all. 
Tough <laughs> told us he was sorry. Hallelujah. He actually understood where we were coming from and gave us an answer to what we were looking for. With the problem solved, Work. the girls hit the booth and started banging out the hit. You ain't never, ever, never, ever seen a girl like me. Happier than they have been in a long time, the girls celebrated their second birthday. Here's to our terrible tunes. And their present will be the biggest hit single of their careers. Do you want a birthday kiss, baby? Damage will become a radio and dance club smash. Ranking as one of the top singles of the year and nominated alongside Britney Spears for Best Pop Video. Coming up, the fans go crazy, the concerts get wild, and the confrontations turn ugly. I'm asking myself, why do I have you here? Kennedy Kane was on fire with their second album, Welcome to the Dollhouse, opening at number one. Already on our first day, we're number one. They became the first female group in Billboard history to debut their first two albums at the top of the charts. Danity Kane, number one again. And with all those hits, the girls prepared for a national tour. Look in my eyes covered in Maybelline. Looking like something fresh out of magazines. By day, they will rehearse together. We have a lot of new material to learn. But their nights will be spent divided. It's not entirely clear what happened, but the split between Aubrey and Andrea that had begun years before was now final. And the two rarely spend time together. Instead, we're going to be celebrating our third year of DK. Think about everything that we've done. Andrea and Shannon were a twosome, as were Dee and Aubrey. You're the boss, too. And Don enjoyed time with her new boyfriend, Q. Three, two, one. We're live. Making the pass for MTV City Tour! <laughs> to the public, Danny D. Kane appeared united. But backstage, Diddy wasn't buying it. My whole career is like I'm really going off a of vibe. It's something I ain't feeling right about this whole situation. And his issues with Aubrey and her look have reached a breaking point. What do you want to look like, though? Do you want to look well, like a Playboy, on... Playmate? Do you want to look like you? Oh, I'm done with what, all of that. No, no, no. Like... What do you want to look okay. like, though? I'll tell what you. What do you look I'll like, though? I'll tell you. I'll tell you. I'm not focused on me, 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 me. I'm focused on what this group should look like and how I should fit in this situation. You like big hair, though. I don't you like do big like hair. You like big hair. You gaming me. Your hair people came in today and they said this is how it needs to be. You know what I'm talking about. Care. You pushing, you're matter. pushing your own you. image, though. I, I don't want you to look like Pamela myself. Anderson. I, I don't want to sign Pamela Anderson. Well, that's what's that, like that, that, that's in the direction where you don't look like her. You don't look like that girl that I signed. I do know who Aubrey is. Puff, it's three years later. Three years later, and you're going in the wrong direction. Why are you having me here? I have you here because I feel you're talented, but don't get it twisted. I'm starting to think about I'm why do I have you here. I'm not getting it Okay, so you're clear on that, though. Understand. Check this out. You're clear on that. You understand now. I'm, I'm asking myself why do I have you here. So I'll move on to something else, up. No, I, and I'll, I'll give you the answer soon. All right? And you may not be here then. Okay, before it gets to If that. anybody want to go with you, they could go too. Don't get it twisted, man. It gets dark and lonely. It does, trust me. From here on, Danity Kane was on a path to destruction. It's gotten to a point where I just, I feel like this situation is getting impossible for me. You know, it's just like, I hate having these, like, these battle moments. Like, I'm really, it's weighing heavy on my heart. At the end of the day, you guys can believe in me all you want, but Puff is running bad boy. He's running our position in Atlantic. He's running the, the, the show. He's running all of this. And at the end of the day, if the guy sitting on the throne really believes all the things that he's been saying about me, then I need to be somewhere else that's going to support and believe in me.
group events, Aubrey began to separate herself from the other girls. Hi guys, thank you. The divisions in Danny became became more public. So I'm on the cover of the fabulous Shador magazine, and tonight Dee Woods and I are going to celebrate my debut. Aubrey is doing fabulous things, despite what some people have to say, and I just want her to know that you know we got to celebrate the things that are you know great for us. Boyfriend. They're all my boyfriend. And Aubrey was not the only group member who stepped out. Danny DeCain shot a cover photo for King Magazine, but to their surprise, two covers came out. One with the group and another with only D Woods. If the group was in trouble, they didn't show it. On the opening night of their tour, the fans went wild. And DK rocked the house. the show, the five girls proved to be a powerhouse, but a new problem emerged. Hey. Hi, I'm Dee Woods. I feel like we're Shannon. Hi. Uh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't know. I know, we just saw her run upstairs. <laughs> she was in a hurry. Oh, yeah. Something was going on. I don't know what's up. <laughs> Rumors surfaced that Andrea was unhappy and wanted out. Andrea. Hey, I hear her. And in San Diego, her family was clearly missing her. And she told me, she's like, can you not be in the group anymore? <laughs> you want the to come home? Then she won't be famous. And she was missing them. Final show of the tour was an overwhelming success, but Danity Kane struggled to stay together. Members began missing shows. Rumors spread that Don was going solo. Aubrey took a role in the Broadway musical production of Hairspray. Hi guys. Diddy called a meeting. Coming up, I don't work these amount of years to have you talk to me this way. I'm not meaning. So I don't want you in the group no more. Danity Kane comes to an end. Anybody else that want to go with her can go with her. Despite his singles and sold out shows, Danity Kane was divided. And Diddy wanted answers. We're coming to a crossroads right now in the reality of our relationship. And it's really just time for some real talk. We got to figure out what the future of the group is. Everyone has something to say. I just want to be in a group. Like, that's it. I don't want to do anything else. I don't want to be, you know, an actress. Like, this was my dream. If everyone's not wanting to do that, then why stay in it? You cannot have five women getting on stage every night, moving forward with a career when there is a lack of trust within each other. We had a show with us for, and Aubrey didn't come because she had to do her obligation in Broadway. When we have a show coming up and maybe Dee has an obligation or maybe Drea has an obligation, when Drea said she wanted to quit, it was going to be us for and playing an uh, audition. To me, that f***ed up. Your business. I think that we just need to refocus. And the divisions in the group have become apparent to Diddy. The vision that I had for the group, this ain't the vision that I'm on. I don't like her energy. I don't like her style and direction where she's going with it. I don't like what she does to the brand when she's wilding out there, being overly 
raunchy, promiscuous. I'm not meaning So I don't want you in the group no more. And anybody else that want to go with her could go with her. Would you like to go with her? Just Would you like to think about it? You want to get out of the group? You have a chance right now to leave with her. You here, right? Yeah, because she was part of the problem of the group for you. No, no, yes, that's not. Was. I really just, I, for me, I don't think that there's, there's, All right. there's not a group okay. without the five of us. Okay. Based on a lot of things that I've heard, you're not really a happy camper in this situation. No. I don't think anyone has been happy for a okay. long time in this situation. Okay, so you could go too. And with that, it was over. I oh. don't... <laughs> I love you, Aubrey. I love you. And Danity Kane will rarely appear together again. Four months later, making the band resume production, and Diddy called the remaining members of Danity Kane back to New York. <laughs> you <a> kidding? <laughs> Is anyone else coming? Is it just you? Just me. Damn it. Everyone keeps thinking that we're going to get back together. Have you spoken to any other girl? Have you? They haven't reached out. Trying to save the group, Don and Andrea went to San Francisco to convince Shannon to come back to Danny D. Kane. <laughs> But Shannon was done, refusing even to appear on camera. Danity Kane had come to an end. Andrea, you're a great person. You're a great girl. But if I did another group, I wouldn't feel comfortable with doing a group with you. And so I've given a lot of thought, and I'm going to let you out your contract, too. for you doing if I decide to put that together Danny D. Kane then you'll be the only member that will still be there so what was it that ultimately ended Danny D. Kane we had a lot of outside that broke us up they don't even know what broke us up they have an idea of what broke us up you know what broke us up I told you what broke us up stand by their mic four three and start to move roof one and up on the roof five five. Five. Finale, all the members of Danny D. Kane except Andrea returned to talk directly to their fans. But from the moment the girls took the stage, the tension was obvious. And there were two questions that needed to be answered. First, what caused the breakup? This group was put together. Okay. And there was not a sound foundation for us. And then a lot of personal things went out of whack. And so when you have both things not working, you don't want to take Explosion. We have to take accountability. People started going to Was D it's not just that her. was the only one that ever supported It's not just her. D Woods was the just, only one that well, ever she's supported the only one that, Well, she's the only one that went to the show because we had shows and she didn't show up. We had to go perform. This entire situation taught us how to survive, and that's what I see people doing right now. They're trying to survive, and I can't hate on that. I don't appreciate, and I don't like how certain people are going about trying to survive, but I have to say... Then after being kicked out, I learned a bigger lesson way beyond anything I learned here, which is you got to fight to stay happy. And most importantly, would they ever get back together? I think if everything could work itself out, absolutely. absolutely. Oh. Be would. Right now, it's a new chapter. Everybody's going on to different things in solo careers. Oh, okay. Big so up to Dawn. That, that, you say no. Hey. No. I, I, you say no. <laughs> Shannon, what you think? I think at this point in time... No, not yet. But my dream is that one day we can come back together. Okay. That's the five. Okay. There will never be another Danny D. Kane unless it's these girls right here. By the end of the night, it was clear that a Danny D. Kane reunion is not going to happen. In the end, some believe Aubrey was at fault. Others believe it was Andrea or D. Woods or Don. Only Shannon would emerge with little criticism. 
you, Shannon. You've been a pleasure to work with. You know what I'm saying? But the story of Danity Kane, for all his troubles, would be their music, their hits, and a recording industry legacy of record-breaking achievements. Five women, when standing together, were a combination of unstoppable power.